Hello and welcome to the stream. This is going to be my first playthrough of Amnesia the Dark Descent. I've heard that it's a pretty creepy game. Um, anybody who is looking for somebody that's like PewDiePie that just hams everything up and is really not scared then uh, you're not going to find that here because I am legit and, you know, 100% authentic kind of thing. I don't ham anything up because, honestly, I don't think I could live with myself if I did because I hate PewDiePie's old videos. They are just... Ugh, no, no. Just not my style. If you like that, hey, more power to you, but uh, no, not, not for me. This will just be a legit playthrough. Um, much like my Soma experience. I mean, the interesting thing is, and the reason I picked Amnesia instead of Outlast for this year, is because I realized that um, Soma is made by the same guys who made Amnesia. And I really, really enjoyed Soma a lot. That is probably one of my most favorite games that I've played. Like, I really like Soma. <laughs> It's a really good game, and so I'm hoping Amnesia is going to be kind of the same. I know it's going to be different, um, a different atmosphere, that's for sure. Because I think, if I remember correctly, I've seen a little bit on Amnesia, not much. Probably just a couple videos here and there, and it was a really, really long time ago. So, And it wasn't any Let's Plays, it was just like reviews or something like that. So I haven't really had anything spoiled, or at least I don't think I have. So that's why I said it's going to be a blind run, because it should be basically blind. Because I don't believe I've ever really seen this game work out in a Let's Play form or something. Well, hello, Facebook. They finally got over their problems, didn't they? Well, that's nice. Yeah, Facebook finally got over their problems. That's quite nice. The last time I was playing, I was trying to um, share my stream the link with it and facebook just wouldn't load up i was trying to load up facebook and it just would not load up it took like five minutes just to load one tab and it wouldn't even load it all the way it would only load it partially it was not great that's for sure so are these windows gonna update or anything like that i don't know maybe they will maybe they won't huh chat's saying there's no users either weird not even myself. Uh, oh, there we go. There's two viewers now. Still no users in chat, though. Hmm. Interesting. Well, that's fine. I just wanted to see if things were just going to update or whatnot. And we should be starting here soon. Here in about a couple of seconds, I'll probably go log my mom in because she didn't have her computer on again, so I had to turn it on just before the stream. So I'm waiting for it to power up all the way. And then we will uh, we'll check out Amnesia of the Dark Descent. Uh, as I said, it feels more medieval to me, I think, but there is like a weird twist to it, I know. There's like really strange stuff, kind of like with Soma as well. But it does feel more medieval, whereas Soma felt more sci-fi. And I kind of like the sci-fi better. But it doesn't mean I'm judging Amnesia. I'm not going to judge it until, you know, I've played it. And they, they even warn you in there to not, not go into the game thinking you're going to win or something. But I, I do hope to actually finish it. Anyway, I will be right back.
Okay, I'm back. So, I set up the Gamma to be really well. Um, I'm not playing in a dark room, of course, because I do need to, you know, see the keyboard and everything. If I was playing by myself, perhaps I'd try these games in a dark room, but, uh, I don't know. I don't know, Soma was a little bit terrifying, and I imagine this is probably even going to be worse. So, I believe Amnesia is their first game, I believe. I could be wrong. Soma might be the first, but I think Amnesia was the first. And then Soma came later. So, without further ado, why don't we just go ahead and start? Oh god, that is really loud. Hold on. Like, super loud in my ears. And it might be too loud for the chat, too, or for the stream. You know what? I think I will turn it down one more. That should still be good for the audio. Uh, there's not much I can do because it doesn't have um, separate audio sliders like Soma did. As you can tell, it is showing its age for sure. I also do have the second um, Amnesia as well. So, what is Custom Story? There it is. What is this? Oh! That may be Steam Workshop. Uh, give me one moment. Does this have Workshop? No. Hold on. This Amnesia mod offers a new tale. It, it might just be mods. I guess it doesn't have Workshop support per se. But that's probably for, like, people who have built their own story, I guess? I mean, it doesn't seem like it comes with, like, a create-your-own-story kind of thing. The way the game was designed to be played is normal. Hard mode is enemies will spot you more easily, tinderbox is more or harder to come by, autosave is disabled, and saving your game costs tinderboxes. Using your sanity will kill you. You know what? Let's just play our normal mode, not hard mode. That seems kind of ridiculous. So yes, I've never played this game. I've, like I said, I've watched a couple previews or reviews of it or something. And I've seen um, PewDiePie react to it, which was ridiculous. But it was only because I was watching a Retsu Prey video and they were making fun of him. So it was justified. <laughs> Don't forget, some things must be forgotten. Shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is this. I am Daniel. I'm guessing he's going to forget. I mean, it is called Amnesia, after all. Uh-huh. Okay, so this game apparently seems to play better than Soma. Sticking at a crisp, crisp 60 FPS, I like it. Streaming at a crisp 60 FPS. I like it. Moving around even still 60 FPS. Hint. A memento has been added to the journal. For quick access to your mementos, press M. Make sure to check these whenever you get stuck. Okay, so M. Ah, mementos. Follow the liquid trail and find its source. Alright. Liquid trail. Oh. Well doesn't just look like any liquid, that kind of looks like blood. Neat. Oh, this is neat. Oh, okay. When grabbing an object, press right mouse button to throw it. Hold down R and move the mouse to rotate the object. Really? Oh, hey, that's much easier than with Soma. Soma, you have to hold down the middle mouse button, and that can get a little cumbersome. 
Ah. Uh, graphics are pretty, gotta say. What happens if I don't follow the trail? Oh, there's nothing in here. Never mind. Like I'm falling. Now it doesn't look like blood, it looks pink. Wait, is this the trail? Ah, just like Soma, very nice. I appreciate the, uh... That's a good thing. Oh, it's a tinderbox. Okay, so that's what those look like. Those are for... Saving? I want to say? Does this have crouching too? Oh no. Please tell me I can change that. I think I changed that in... Yeah, key config. There we go. Let's see here. Crouch. Can I change this to C? I just prefer C to be crouch because left control is so damn far away. It feels so awkward. But C is like right there below D. It feels really good to just reach down there and boom. What? Button R D? What the hell does that mean? Let's head to where the look control points. Useful for peeking around corners. Huh. I don't know what button RT is, but uh, Q and E are to lean, just like in Soma. That's fine. W is D. That's fine. Left shift to run, crouch, and jump to space. Jump for space. Okay, that's perfect. That should work out just fine. Let's go back to the game. It does feel a little bit old. After playing Soma, it does feel a bit dated. But again, I've never played it before, so who knows? I don't have a tinderbox? Damn. That's good stuff. Let's see if it's got explosion physics. Well, I mean, the bottle breaks, but uh, it doesn't interact with the fire, which is pretty sad. Tinderboxes are used to light candles and other light sources in the environment. The current number of tinderboxes is shown in the inventory tab, which is 10. 2, okay. So I think this is your health, and this is your sanity. And this is the journal. And that's for the lantern that you get later, and this is your inventory. So it's probably going to be a little bit more confusing than Soma, I would imagine. Is there anything to light in here? I kind of feel like I probably don't want to light every candle. But you probably just want to light the ones that you need to light. Since you have limited tinder boxes, probably. Because you could probably even light these, right? You could. But why? You could literally waste your tinder boxes right here because there's two head candles. Something over there? Hold on a tick. I need to change the options again real quick. The uh, sensitivity kind of sucks. I need to turn that up just a smidge. That is still pretty shitty. I hate having to move all the way over the whole entire mouse to just look a tiny bit. Let's try two and see what that's like. Man, that still seems really bad. Is it that I need to go down? If I go to point five, is that really horrible? That good. I mean, it literally doesn't seem to cha to make any difference. At all, I wonder why. Like, oh, oh, that stick look sensitivity. No freaking wonder. I'm an idiot. I need mouse sensitivity. There we go. That's helping out. Okay, that feels pretty natural. Much better. 
It just, it was so, so slow. I prefer a much better sensitivity. Whoa, hey. Okay. What's going on here? What the hell? Hey, character, I'm not being able to control you. Why was he working at this black thing here? Dude, it's just a banner. It's okay. So yeah, this seems to be some kind of a castle or something. Like it wants me to go in here. Beware. When standing in darkness, your sanity will slowly drain. Turn on lights in the environment, use your tinder boxes, or search for other sources of light. Uh I could just leave. A slight headache. Oh. But it's such a search for other sources of light, man, that really is dark. It... Oh hey. That's a source of light. But I can't actually use it. I mean I guess you have to do something like this. There we go. And then we can look at the paintings. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Alrighty then. So bad that I already use a tanger box though. Pretty sad. But they did assure me that on normal mode there would be more tinder boxes than hard mode, so that's good at least. But short Nothing good there. Heading on down. It is called the Dark Descent after all, right? Is this door lead to them? They have loading in this one, huh? The loading was cleverly load uh masked in Soma, really. Traveling to Dover meant going through Canterbury. I made sure to pay a visit to avoid. I probably should have started reading that earlier. No enough time. Where did that wind gust even come from? There's no window. Huh. Witnessing unsettling events will reduce your sanity. It can be increased by completing puzzles and making progress. Oh, good. Good. Completing puzzles, huh? Fun. Is this dark? Ooh, tinder boxes. Look at that. That's quite nice. Oh. Cockroaches? Nasty. Hey, what is this over here? Never mind. Just a pile of books, I think. It's super dark. That's okay, there's light right here. Does light return your sanity? I don't know. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. Ooh. Hey, look at that, they knocked a tinder box right off. I'll take that. Wait, that's not a tinder box. That's the lantern. You have picked up the lantern. When filled with oil, it can be turned on by pressing F or selecting it in the inventory. Just a book. It does have kind of the same interactivity of um, that Soma had, where you can like pick up everything, but it feels like it doesn't have as much interactivity. I could be wrong. Oh, tinder box, nice. Like that. Um, I guess that's all for this room. I feel like I'm not really getting all that much inventory. Oh, hey, I do have lantern oil. Look at that. I didn't know it came with oil. Used to keep the lantern flame alive. When it runs out, the lantern can no longer be used. Okay, well, I don't know 
how fast the lantern oil burns, but it's probably not a super good thing to let it burn all the way out. Hold on a second. There's something else out here. Indeed. Oh. It's just rubble. Never mind. That's a nice light, though. Gotta say, for the game being all, as old as it is, it looks pretty damn good. Oh, it opens that way, okay. Understandable. Um... Okay. Man, I wish the tent your boxes weren't so tiny. It could be kind of difficult to find. So far, I think I found them all, though. Hey, there's one. I got you a little tinder box. And. What, was I in the darkness there? It doesn't seem like in the darkness. Is that a candle? It is. Is that a book that you can read? Nope. That's fine. Oh, hey, look, a tender box. And a broom. Get out of here, broom. Uh, probably nothing here, I would imagine. Is this a... No, it's not a chest. I thought it was. This is nice. Warm up by the fire. Sit here and crouch and warm up by the fire. But no, we must press on and make progress. Hmm. Okay, okay, you want me to look at that, I get it. What is this thing? Picked up oil. Lantern oil drains when it's turned on. Add more oil to the lantern, double click on the oil item in the image. How much does it add, though? Let's find out. Okay, so it doesn't add the whole thing. Okay, good. 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits, and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Odd. See, is there anything else here? This looks like all the things you do science with in Miasmata. Uh, this room is really dark. Just gonna look and see. Ooh, there's a lever. Bam. Uh, I mean, I guess that was probably completing a puzzle. I think that was getting more sanity. We don't want to use the lantern too much, though. I don't want to use up all the oil. Door slammed shut behind him, and he knew he would never again see the old tailor at Berkeley Square. Damn it. Why can't they just let me click that? To run, hold down left shift while moving. Yeah, it's completely fine. Let's see here. Well, I mean, it doesn't burn too much oil, it seems like. I had it on for a little bit there. Oh, good. A nice big empty room. 
I love big empty rooms. Huh? Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Mm hmm. Okie dokie. Let's see. I want to explore. I know it wants me to go that way, but I do want to explore just to see if I can find items and stuff. Here, I thought I was the only one here. Apparently not. It's just rubble. Doo -doo. Where did this go to? Archives. Okay. This is not where I came in. That's for sure, I think. I actually read these things because they, they're never on long enough for me to read them. Although that one seemed to be on a while. Oh boy. Looking good. Seems like a good time. Nice and dark. Fantastic. Well, we can light some candles. There we go. So what exactly is special about this place? Perhaps I'm not even supposed to be here. Probably not. Hey, you know what? I think I changed my mind. Let's do what the game intends us to do, shall we? The loading screens are going to get a little bit old. Then again, like I said, this is an older game than Soma. I'm actually really surprised that Soma had so little loading screens, or it had masked loading screens that made it seem like there were no loading screens. Oh. I thought that just led back down to the room, but apparently not. Already getting lost. That's a good sign. Can you hurt yourself by falling? Must be tested. No. Perhaps if the fall is a bit longer, maybe you can hurt yourself. I almost feel like this game is going to punish you for exploring. Alright, well that's something. Seems like most, maybe most items are in treasure chests like that. Ah! Hey, I saw you over there. Lantern oil, get over here. Oh. And big giant doors. Oh, that's, uh... Huh? Yeah, okay. Apparently that is the game's way of saying, no, you're not going this way, buddy. Weird. Covered in some, like, skin or something. I don't know. Don't know how to feel about that. But apparently it was letting me go to the archives, which is weird. And these are doors. Are these loading doors? Or Yeah, that's laboratory. That loads. You can tell because when it does the icon of the door, that's going to be a loading screen. And it's going to take you to a new area. Wine cellar. Okay. So this must be the main hub here. I'm thinking. And I probably don't want to go to these other places because maybe nothing's set up. Perhaps it's supposed to be scarier, but this is more of a trigger horror game, kind of like Selma was. And if you go somewhere when you're not supposed to, you don't get scares because nothing's triggered yet. But I know I'm supposed to go here. Ugh. Close. 
What the hell is this? Hold on. Some sort of organic tissue blocks the path to the refinery. Can it be dissolved? Um, it's, it is tough and pliant. Can't be torn by hands or tools. Okay. Well then, where exactly do you want me to go, game? This is where the drops were. I don't see any other drops. Hmm. Perhaps this is where I'm supposed to... Um... To explore on my own. I would think maybe the laboratory would have something that could maybe get rid of that. Laboratory, acids, kind of sounds like it goes hand in hand. Maybe not. Oh good, it's nice and dark, that's fantastic. That's always good. I think I'll keep the lantern out for now. No? Oh yeah. Just witnessing weird things happening. Here, we can tinderbox it up. There we go. I'm in the light. Not be losing sanity, right? Maybe. Hmm. Let's see. Is there anything good here? Look at barrels. They like to hide stuff behind stuff. Oh, I think it's just rats that I'm hearing. Well, this is a pretty junky laboratory. Is anyone Let's there? All right, so since I'm gonna, okay. There should be more cooperites. Let me see. Let me see here. And one part aqua force. Hmm. Yeah, had I known this was both the same creators, I would have probably played this first. So early alchemy experiment. This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae, whatever that is. Okay. Form of compounds. Early experiment was unsuccessful. Ah, the solution is highly acid, which is probably supposed to be acidic. Uh huh. So I was right. I bet it is going to be an acid that we need. Get out of the way, box. Oh, no tinder. No tinder boxes, but there's one. Hmm, lots of books. What the hell? Okay. Don't look at it. Or lantern oil. Do I need to fill my lantern? Might as well fill it a little bit. Doesn't seem to burn as fast as I was thinking it would. Chemical relocation. Oh. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. Okay, so I guess that means we're going to the wine cellar next. Aha! That means the laboratory was the perfect place to start. Get out of here. Is there anything in here? Oh, there's a treasure. Oh, that's not a treasure. There's a tinderbox! These are not treasures. They're just boxes. Oh, wait. There's a treasure. Another tinderbox. Sweet. Alright. We're out of here. Hmm, now what about the other side, though? Curious as to what's on this other... Oh, never mind. Just rubble. Anything here? Oh, lantern oil. Nice. Well, it does seem like I'm gonna have a ton. Okay. Let me see here real quick. Head is pounding and hands are shaking. Oh. Okay, well that's not good. I don't know what to do about that. 
I don't think anything can be done. But we have the next place we're supposed to go, and that's the wine cellar. So let's head there. Man, these loading screens are going to get really annoying, though. Because then there's a loading screen, and then there's going to be immediately another loading screen. Because this is the wine cellar, I believe. Yep. What? It's locked and it will not open without a key. Oh, good. That's just fantastic. Well, I didn't see a key in the laboratory. So it leads me to believe that it's in the archives. Because that's the only other place we can go. Unless... Nope, that's boarded up. Let's go check out the archives. I guess. Maybe one of those... Um, maybe one of those notes that I kind of glanced over, um, probably said something about hiding the key in the archives or something like that. The place just looks so big. The archives part looks so big. Let's see, find the key to the wine cellar. Chemical ingredients have been moved from the laboratory to the wine cellar. Evidence in the laboratory was re has revealed that combining four chemicals can create a powerful acid. Okay. Good. Good. My sanity's already feeling weird. Oop. Got anything in here? Nope. It's funny how they're like giving me tutorials about this and stuff. It's like, dude, I did this in Soma. In Soma, it was a little bit better, though. It felt a little bit better. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Hmm. Interesting. Can you light fireplaces? Probably not. I could light this, but I mean, it's even the point, really. It seems like it's bright enough in here. Why waste the tinder if you don't need to, right? Wait, does this look like the same place that I was? Did I open this door before? Oh yeah, because I lit that candle over there. Apparently it stays lit. That's pretty nice. Hmm. As I hear creepy sounds and stuff, I don't like it. What you got in here? Tinderbox? Hey, you got a key in here? It seems like a good place to hide a key. Uh-huh. Nope. No key. What about in here? That would be too easy, wouldn't it? It probably would. This this game has a very layers of fear feel to it. Although I don't think you could die in layers of fear. I don't see anything there. Oh yeah, because I remember going this way. Well, this is nice and bright at least. Good. I like it. What you got? Nothing. And? Nothing. And? Nothing. Just shirts. Nobody wants shirts. 
Anything? Nope. Oh, tinderbox. I'll take that. I'm sure I'll need them. That's why you search everything, bro. Leave no stone unturned. Hmm. What do we got here? 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. That doesn't sound good. Poor oh, guy, is this supposed to be Daniel writing these notes? I'm not 100% sure. Oh. oh, that's pretty dark. What have we got in this darkness? What is this thing? Oh. Pretty damn dark. Go ahead and light that. So I don't have to use my... Whoa. Yeah, that's not really giving off much light, is it? Jeez. Good. More darkness? Yeah, more darkness. The light. Man, these candles suck. They aren't giving off much light, I'll tell you that much. Oh, a tinderbox inside of the stove. Pretty cool. Hey, a treasure chest. What you got in here? Ooh, a tender box and it's oil. Ew. I mean, I suppose you could just light up a whole bunch of lights, but, I mean, why, right? If you're gonna explore something... That's yeah, a solid object. If you're gonna explore something, just use the... Um, just, just light one candle. Might as well. And then if you have to go into the dark, use the... Um... Uh, lantern, that's it. I want to call it a candle for some reason. It's not a candle, it's a lantern. It's the middle one. Nothing there. Man, these candles suck. Why are they so bad? It won't open, it's locked. Okay. Door leading to the local history room is locked. Is there another entrance? Um, please. Is there? Um, you know what? Let's go back a little. Hey, can you light these things? Oh, you can. You can light the sconces. That's pretty nice. So I've already looked there. I've already been here and searched here. What about this way? I have not been this way. So this was the beginning, I think. Pretty sure. I haven't been over here. Wait a minute, isn't this the same room that I was just in? Huh. Well, that's pretty nifty. Wow! Look at that painting. Holy moly. That's a big painting. Jeez. Why did I have a feeling that was going to happen? Can I play the piano? Nope. It's too bad. Wow, look at these giant paintings! God, they must have taken forever to paint. No? Hmm. Where the hell was 
that noise? Like something singing. Something otherworldly. Is that lantern oil? Yes, it is. Huh? Something sniffing or something? I don't like it. Bite that real quick so I can check these drawers. Remember, we are looking for a key. Just object. Nothing really important. Ugh. A bunch of those rolled up papers. What does that say? Hmm. I have no idea. Man, everything gets super dark. Maps. Jesus. Hmm. What we got here? Is there nothing to light in here? Well, there is. There's this. Wait, I don't have to burn my lamp, which I am kind of burning the the oil, but add a little bit more. Not a big deal. The hell? Dude, aren't you supposed to be reading the note? 17th of May, oh. 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Wait, am I supposed to do that? Oh, I am. It was slowly moving, so I... Ooh, it's very pretty. It was waiting. For me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. It's very pretty. Oh, it's so bright. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety, and grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Huh. Alrighty then. Still looking for a key. And nope. Ooh, what is this? A book. Apparently you can throw them very far away. I don't want that sanity to go down. Check this place out. Nice, looks like it's bright enough. Oh, a chest. Very nice. Ooh, two tinder boxes, nice. Yeah, you do kind of have to. The hell? Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble, and there's a risk everything will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Hmm. Hmm. Eastern. Eastern Hall. East Wing. I guess these are supposed to be maps? Okay, so what am I missing then? That damn key. Huh? Is this the way I came in? 
the hell? Must find a new way out of this area. Uh. Ow? Kinda seems like it's all pretty... Wait, is that it? No. All pretty sealed in. Trapped? Do I have to use this? Fragile, but not breakable by hand. Oh, sure. Super useful. Wait, does that mean I need to pick up something really heavy? Is there anything really heavy around here? Imagine books aren't very heavy. And these little maps are definitely heavy. They're super light. And and again, books are probably not heavy enough. Ah. No such luck. Hmm. What this thing? Can I pick it up? Hey, can you pick up a big old boulder? No. Not a single one. Well, I'll be damned. That thing heavy enough? Probably not. Nope. But it does break. Oddly satisfying. Wait, what about this? There's a boulder. Or a statue. There we go. That worked out. Now jump. Nope. You have to be swift. When you activate the first one, you hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. Okay. There's some sort of secret door mechanism in the local history room. Okie dokie. That's really dark. I don't like this one. I imagine there's gonna be some kind of a puzzle here. Oh, hey. Hello. Time to break the glass. Yeah! <laughs> you can break all the glass! There we go. Do I want this book? Is this useful for something? I have no idea. Well, what the mechanism is, I need to check with my lantern. Oh, this looks familiar. Aha! The other book. Is there like another book or something? Oil. What in the hell? Oh, it stopped. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna burn all my oil away. Yeah, I could tinderbox this thing. That ought to help. Oh, hey, there's a door. Oh, right, that's the door I need to open. Hmm. What in the hell is the other thing I need to do? Because it's obviously this book. Pretty obvious. But I don't see any other book that's really standing out. I don't see, like, a lever or anything, or maybe that book opens something? I didn't see anything open. Hmm. Give it a shot again. It's gotta do something. 
fun. Oh, damn it. Oh, there we go. What, am I just supposed to open the door now? Oh. What? No, oh, that's just a book. Oh, here we go. That good? Oh, there's another one. Okay. How many of these are there? Oh, there we go. Great. Hello. An empty room. In there. Um. Oh, at the key? Finally. Finally found a wine cellar key. All you do is pick up a key. I swear. Just a key. We need to get crazy, game. Starting closing of the wine cellar. Hmm. Well, that's progress. Let's head to the wine cellar. Wait, how am I supposed to do that if I'm stuck here? That door opens now. Oh, it is open. Cool. That's mighty useful. Wait a minute. Studio. Oh yeah, that's that one that won't open. Hmm. Right in there. I should probably sell my lantern oil. That would probably be a good idea. That's getting a little bit on the low side. There we go. Yeah, that'd be good. Out where the hell to go? Maybe this way? Oh, yeah, this is gonna be that big room again. Huh? Another weird sound again? Why? Huh? Huh? I don't like that sound. <laughs> Creepy. Get out of here. Something's in there and it's time to leave. The hell? The fuck? Run! Run, dude. There's obviously something right behind you. Get into the light. Maybe you'll be safe. The hell? And all is good. Really? I saw blood, but my health is all good, they say. Okay, well, um, I'll trust you, game. Head on down to the wine cellar. Can't get much worse, could it? Seven tinder boxes, that's pretty okay. I think. Oh, you have to use the key, right. Um. There we go. Oh, you don't double click it. You just single click it to use it. Okay, I got it. You only double click the oil. Oh. Okay. Nice and dark. Fantastic. Yeah, 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 I know. You've already told me about the darkness slowly dra draining my sanity. I'm trying to not have the lantern out too much. Hey, this looks like the laboratory. Hey, I have a lantern. Where did the siren go? Who cares? He left us enough wine to last us a lifetime. Or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> Is there anything to light? In this big room? I guess there's nothing. Hold on a second. Hmm? If an enemy is near, stay out of sight and hide in the darkness. Make sure to turn off your lamp if possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would imagine. This? Oh, I thought that had a lock on it. It's not. 
Ah, look, something to light. Perfect. Now I can give my lantern a bit of a rest. Oh, maybe I can't. Hmm. Anything here? I see something back here. Nope, oh, never mind. Oh, what's this? Picked up laudanum. <laughs> Jesus, what the hell? Well, the bad thing is, you don't want to hide in the darkness, or else your sanity is going to go. Huh. I wonder what the hell that thing was. I don't appreciate it. Something over here? Is my sanity going crazy? My my screen is flashing red. What's this? Ender box, nice. Uh seems like a pretty bad place to be. Right? That's just the beginning, I think. What am I even coming here for? A tinderbox. How are you supposed to hide from the creature in the dark if that kills your sanity? Oh, hey. Look at this. Be good. Oh, my lantern worked out. I think that's where I started. Candles suck. Give you like no freaking light at all. Or something. But I don't know what. Oh good. Hey, look. It's something. No. There. Must be drafty in these castles, eh? Oh, hey, look. Hello, mine. Oh, gee. Light something. Okay, there's a tinder box. We have seven tinder boxes left. I we should be a little bit more careful, probably. I don't know. Maybe I'm doing okay. Who knows? Got to look at with the lantern all the time. Those things are terrible. What is this? This barrel contains a few drops of oil. Oh. He filled lantern with a few drops of oil. Oh. Cool. Oh, no, no oil. Okay. Um. Okay, well, I think I'm stuck? I guess I'm supposed to get up top, but I don't really understand how they want me to do that. 
Oops, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to turn off my lantern. There we go. Not moving. Oh, this wants to move. These things are too heavy. What? When holding an object, you can click right mouse button to give it an extra push. That seems to do too much. Not doing anything. Tutorial, you're not helping me any. I don't suppose I can just get up there, can I? I think so. Obviously, it wants me to get up. At least I should be safe in here. That's some solace, probably. <laughs> Maybe. What about this? This looks pretty weak here. Maybe. Do it. Am I supposed to climb this shell? Is that even possible? Hey, dumb dogs. No, I don't think it's possible. What does it want me to do? Rope? No, it's just there. What is this? Brick? Pretty heavy. That doesn't do anything. Oh, hey, that maybe worked. Seemingly. I still can't get out the door. <laughs> too heavy. Yeah, okay. Guess you're just supposed to take these and just kind of throw it at it until it works. Maybe. I saw the door open a little bit. This is not working. I think this is getting anywhere. Making more of a mess, I think. Hmm. What does it want me to do? I'm just stuck in this room. There's no way out. As far as I can tell. If there's anything that looks weak. What about this? Wood. What is this thing? I don't know. Hammer. Not much. Stone walls over here. Beams that have collapsed, stone walls over here. There's this wooden thing here. I feel like that's what it wants me to do, but I just... What, what exactly does it want me to do? Okay. Well, hammer got stuck. Hammer, can, can you use and get these arrows out, or these, these nails? What in the hell? Is this just the end of the game? 
Is that how it is? I mean, there's definitely something out there. I don't know what the hell to do. I mean, I can't get any higher. Unless maybe take these off and jump over there. Well, I kind of worked. Not really. See, this is where I could use the tutorial. So it could tell me what in the actual fuck I'm supposed to do. It's gonna work? Kind of, but not really. Again. Get up there! Get up! Nope, oh, doesn't seem to work. This door will not open. Not at all. Oh, I guess that's the end of the game for me. <laughs> Cause I can't figure out what the hell it wants me to do. I'll just start pulling out boxes and just hope for the best that something's hidden. Out of there. Wait a minute. Does this look like old and decrepit maybe? Maybe I'm supposed to break it? Nope. No such luck. Can't pull the shelves. Chair. What in the hell am I supposed to do, game? What is your... What is your major malfunction here, game? What in the hell do you want me to do? Can I light this on fire or something? No. Well, I mean, I guess this might be a super short stream because this just seems to be the end. I wish I could open this damn door. I mean, it's kind of opening, sort of. Get the fuck out of the way, you stupid pillars. Is that working? Never gonna open because I think it opens inward. Unless you can just break it. Ugh. What in the hell am I supposed to do? Maybe a chair? I'm not gonna do anything. Let me out! Move this rock. Get out of the way, rock. I don't know what to do. seems to me like there's just nothing to do. I'm just stuck. That's it. I mean, I've already made a total mess of the room. Unless there's something I'm missing. This is just a box. This is just a barrel. This is just an inkwell. And there goes my lantern. Which is fine, because like I said, I have no fucking clue what I'm supposed to be doing. Is this weak? And there's cracks in it. I would definitely say Soma is definitely better. I mean, I don't know if I'm just supposed to like stack these blocks up and make a stairway up there. Did they really make you do that? Kind of a dick move. Yeah. Oh, good. 
a shot. It's not even gonna work. They do give you all these blocks. That is what you're supposed to do. Definitely a hole up there. That is the whole idea. Uh, I can't reach anything else, damn it. Where did that barrel go? There it is. I kinda want this barrel. Come with me, barrel. And then, damn it, rotate, 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 and drop. Maybe that will work? That'll be high enough? Damn it. Wait a minute. Is there a way up up here? There's already tables set up. Maybe if I put a barrel on the table? Get up there? These physics based puzzles are not fun. I don't know what the hell they were thinking with this. Damn it. Fine. Didn't they just do normal puzzles? That was one of the good things about Soma. I didn't have any physics-based puzzles. This is this is kind of bullshit. It's gonna work now. Is that not even a freaking hole? Is the game just broken? Do I need to restart? Was it supposed to do something and then it didn't do it? Yeah, that's not even a freaking hole. This is just literally useless. I mean, I feel like you're supposed to break something, though. But nothing breaks, so I guess I'm just gonna try and restart, I guess? Just do a save and exit, and then just try and restart. Maybe it'll load correctly this time? I have no idea. Nope. It's literally just back in this room again. No, I guess this might be just the end. Because I... What? Am I supposed to lose my sanity? Is that the deal? Well, I can't really lose my sanity if these things are lit. So did I just soft lock myself if that were to happen? Am I supposed to push these blocks out of the way of these boulders? Get out of the way! Maybe. It does seem like I've, mo I've made some progress on uncovering the door, at least. But if this is what you have to do, this is absolute horseshit. I hope this never happens again. There. Now will you open? Oh look, now it opens. Amazing. That is some dumb horse shit though, I'll tell you. What? There's no oil. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I should probably put some oil in it, shouldn't I? Now I don't even have much oil. Great. Makes that stupid freaking room. Ew, gross. The giblets? Pretty nasty. I really hope there aren't too many of those physics-based puzzles, because that was not fun. Maybe it wasn't even supposed to do that. What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Oh. My God, Wilhelm, do something! And your box? Accepting. We're not getting out. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> what was he doing to people?
I don't even know. I'm not even sure I want to know. Where to now? Don't want to have the lantern out too much. Lose my sanity either. Is that a... Like a floor plan? Do I have everything I need? One, two, three... I don't. I need like one more chemical, don't I? It said four chemicals, I think. I remember being in here. I remember going there. I don't ever remember closing this door again, but the monster creature probably closed it. Where have I been here? Where I first saw him. What in the hell? Where's the last chemical then? It's kind of a little unfair. Sanity is going to go way down. I've already been here. This is where I was here. Didn't even find a chemical in there. There was nothing in here. As far as I can tell. So I missed something. Yeah, I did miss something. Wow, these candles are freaking worthless. Wait, wasn't there something in there? I think it was a chemical, though. Or if it was, I already grabbed it. Oh! Duh, it's right freaking here. There we go. There we go. Now we got everything we need. Now we can get the hell out of here, hopefully. Time to leave. Something screaming. I'm not gonna give it the time of day. I don't know what was up with that room. I mean, I guess they just expected you to push all that stuff out of the way. I mean, you couldn't pick up those rocks. They're too heavy, obviously. Whoa. Jesus. Ah, jeez. What the hell? What the hell? What was that? Do anything, jeez. I didn't think there was a creature or anything. How are you supposed to not take damage? Uno momento. Damn. And now I'm down to no lantern oil. Isn't that lovely? Wait, this isn't even where I want to be. I have to go to the laboratory now. At least I believe so. Wait a minute. And they even get to the laboratory? Oh, Jesus. Is this stuff just gonna hurt me? Well, gotta go through it. I have to get to the laboratory. Got the chemicals, so now I can make that acid and I can burn the, the skin stuff or whatnot. But yeah, this one was definitely not made as well as Soma, that's for sure. Huh, now where was everything? I think the thing was over here. No. Oh yeah, there's only one way, that's right. The other way is just rubble. This is the right way. Down these creepy corridor steps. Yep. Here we go. Now what am I looking for? What thing at? Ah, here's the science. Here's the place that you do the science. I think. Let's light this one. 
shall we? Now we won't lose sanity, hopefully. And then I'm guessing you just kind of put these things in there. Oh, you do have to double click. Huh? Oh, hey, it just goes where it's supposed to go. That's nice. Tells me it doesn't want me to make this mixture. Well, too bad. Doing it anyway. Okay. Oh, there we go. Aha! Uh -huh. Watch the science happen. Science? Oh, right. I should probably release these too. Huh? Wait. Yo, we'll turn the same direction as you rotate. Okay. There we go. Good. Come on. Good. And good. There we go. There needs to be a container below the contraption. Oh, well. Right, that seems to make sense. I guess it would be this. I forgot about the, chem about the chemistry pot. My bad. No object to use item on? Are you... Are you kidding me? What am I just supposed to put it on the contraption? Oh, there we go. Okay, it's just part of the thing. You don't actually put it over there. Alright, that's fine. Do it again. There we go. Well, alrighty then. Picked up pot of acid. Alright. Progress is being made. Um. Is it just me or are the stairs gone? Wait a minute, what? Stairs have collapsed. Find a way to climb back up. Ah, it's just fantastic. Oh, good. This place that it was rubble is not rubble anymore. Huh. Well, I don't suppose... that that's gonna help any? Uh, maybe. Go check it out, I guess. Ah, uh, guess not. Hmm. I love the way it's just like, find a way to climb back up. You can use objects to reach hard to get places. Yeah. I think I have an idea of what to do. Use these as like bridges or something. Like that, maybe? Yeah, it seems to work. And one more. Whoa, jeez. I hate physics-based puzzles. They're awful. Oh god. Wait, did that just snap into place? If it did. And it did. That's cool. Might have just been a fluke, but uh, I'll take it. I may have to quit this game early though, because I really do not like physics-based puzzles. They are not fun. Oh god. Ow. Ow. Stupid flesh garbage. When you step on it, it hurts you, but now that that doesn't, apparently. Jeez. Well, that's fine. Let's go this way. This is the next place to go. Now that we can finally burn that thing. Oops. There we go. Alrighty, so now we use the acid on it, right? Is that just going to use up the acid? Well, there's the achievement. Unlocked Alchemist. It did use up all the ac acid. I wonder if I have to make more. I bet I do. Hmm. 
something. Well, not really. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason for the darkness, that is? Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Can't keep going straight. I'm going to use up all my lantern oil. Badly. Careful when enemies draw near. Uh oh. Doesn't seem good. Am I gonna lose sanity though? Slight hurt. A few cuts and bruises. Oh, I'm hurt. I don't have a whole lot of uh, lantern oil either, so be careful. He's gonna kill me. Uh, I like it. Hey, lantern oil, that's nice. Hey, there's a tinder box. I thought that might be something back here. Why do we hear a dog or something? That's pretty not good. What? Oh. I didn't actually open that. <laughs> I'm kind of running out of tinder boxes. What the hell is this? Laudanum? I don't know what that thing is. Stupid laudanum stuff. A medical bracer to improve health and culture. Oh! Oh. Tutorial. Don't you think it would have been nice if you would have told me that? You never even told me that. I picked up the stuff and I'm just like, mm, I don't know what this is. 1839. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it, lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Um, maybe? I don't know. It does seem entirely plausible. Maybe. There are, there's so many freaking doors! Oh. We can see a place I've already been. There's so many dumb doors. Oh, this looks interesting. Oh my gosh, it's a lantern oil thingy. Huh? What the hell is that noise? Crazy. Hey, what kind of lantern oil you got? It's now fully refilled. Oh. And it only has a few drops in it now. Okay. Cool. Is there anything to light in here that looks pretty nice? Oh my god, what the hell is this? Not just too heavy to lift by hand. Okay. Obviously gotta do something with this lever here.
I mean, I have a lantern full of oil. Can't I just use the oil? I like a tinderbox and a thingy. Oh, another tinderbox. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. I'm lighting these things with a tinderbox. It doesn't really seem to help much. It gives off so very little light. Alright. How's my lantern working? Okay, not too bad. Good. Fantastic, so there's nothing I can do here. Great. What's in here? There has to be something to complete that puzzle, I would imagine. Some item somewhere. Hello? Anything? What's this? A rope? Oh, hello. Why in the world do doors keep closing? 25th of June, 1839. I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirm my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass. How it eventually collapses on itself, like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Hmm. Weird. Your sanity is dangerously low. Make sure to stay in the light and try to make progress. Uh, why would it be dangerously low? Dot, dot, dot. Why would it be dangerously low? I'm in the light right now. Yes, it just happens. Okay, well, uh, good to know. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh god, it's such a mess. Where the hell am I even supposed to go? Am I going backwards? Oh, I am going backwards. God dang it. Anything here? No, I like this. This was where the monster was, or the person, or whatever the hell it is. What's over here, I wonder? You've been here. Okay, so that means I've been everywhere. Right? So, how exactly? First thing? Not opening. This is gonna be the little cubby hole. Right. So there is literally nothing for me to make progress with. Unless there's an item that I'm just not seeing. But I don't. Wait a minute. No, that's the thing to light. This is where I just was. Oh, is my sanity better now? Maybe? Does it get better as you're in the light? No, it's still dot dot dot. Well, what in the actual hell? So, where the hell is my item to make progress? I mean, obviously, I'm thinking it's going to be oil of some sort. It's all just alcohol. Something to light, but I don't need it. Doesn't open. Doesn't matter, because you can go in this room anyway. It's right here. Just this room. 
This room also seems to be nothing. Ow! Damn, don't step in that stuff. Really not a good idea. Um... Okay... So, what in the hell am I supposed to do? I... I don't know what to do! Looked everywhere, this thing doesn't freaking work. Something is clogging the crank and pulley contraption. Gee, what could it possibly be? I don't have a damn clue. I mean, I would guess that it means that I need oil. Oh, see, now I can open the door. Huh. Get out of here. All that does is just make a shortcut. Which doesn't help in the least. Oh, good. Now I've got little cockroaches on my screen. That's fun. Is that because my sanity is crazy? I have a fountain. I mean, a fountain. I have the lantern on. Seriously. Another tinderbox. Jesus. I've been in here. I don't know why the door's closed, but I've been here. I'll just pull everything out of the way. Gotta be here somewhere. Ugh. Let's see another tender box. I oh, just grab it. Thank you. There's something behind here, maybe? No, that would make way too much sense. Well, I mean, it may just be a short stream. I may just do Soma for this Halloween. As, I mean, this is pretty much the end. Where is my... Where's my item to make progress? I have no idea. As long as you're careful and you don't step on this stuff for very long, it doesn't hurt you, I think. You can't do anything with these. Nothing at all. There's bones and stuff, but who cares? Can't do anything with it. That just goes back that way again. This is back this way again. Yeah, sadly, I think I may just have to stop playing because I don't have a damn clue what this game wants me to do. Unless it wants me to go back in this passageway, I mean, I guess I'll try. Maybe I missed something in the passageway? I don't think I did. I'm pretty sure there was nothing to miss. Rocks and stuff. Sure, I'm going to use up like all my lantern oil, but I'm probably done with the game anyway because the puzzles in this game seem kind of dumb. Like, what am I supposed to do with this? There we go, we're just back at the beginning again. Now, I mean, it seemed like it was pretty easy to figure it out because I was like, oh, well, I mean, it's easy. You just turn the crank, but the crank doesn't freaking work. So if the crank doesn't work, well, I figured maybe oil it, but I, I can't find an item. I've looked everywhere. Let's relook a couple places. I mean, you can see I've thrown all these barrels around, just seeing if there's anything hiding anywhere at all, ever. Unless it needs this or something. I've never seen that before. It doesn't need that. It's just an asset of some sort. Ugh. And I've already looked behind here. There was nothing there. Nothing in any of the wine cellar things. Nothing in this room. Already looked. And this is the room with the... Ew, that thing is moving. That's gross. This is the thing with the pulley system. 
Oh wait, is it talking about that? Is that what's jammed in it? Could be. Well, if so, I just wasted all my lantern oil. Could be. Yep. That's it. Well, wouldn't you know it. Thanks, game, for making me waste all my lantern oil. I appreciate it. Really nice of you. Fall and pretty much die. Good. Okay, so I'm not feeling too well, so maybe I should probably use one of these. Ah, there we go. We cut some bruises. There we go. Not so bad. Mm hmm. That's not very good. Cellar archives, huh? Okie dokie. Huh? Oh good. Wait, now I'm in the water? What in the hell? Um... I've done this before. I know how this works. Maybe. You just stay out of the water and you're safe, I think. But... How does one stay out of the water? Okay. Aha! See? I know this all too well. This was the same thing they did in Spooky's House of Jump Scares, too. That's gonna drain all the water, right? Maybe not. Oh god, don't tell me it's timed. Please don't tell me it's timed. I don't even know what the damn thing does. Is it timed? Or is it just working? Because if it's timed, I'm just gonna wait and let it run out. Flip it again. Wait, if it is timed, it sure is taking a long time. Oh no, it sounds like a motor's running or something. Oh no, it's timed, of course. Why wouldn't it be timed, right? Run, run, run! No idea where I'm going, but run, run, run anyway. This is probably not where I need to be, but there's something to heal. Oh, look at that thing. It's right on top of me. Damn. Not even anything there. It's just a splash. It's literally all it is. There's literally nothing there. Look. Nothing. It's just a splash. Well, that was not the right way to go. You're just a splash. You're not even scary. Because you're just a splash. You're not even a creature. At least in Spooky's House of Jump Scares, there was a creature there. You could see it. Aha. Okay, I think we know what that switch does now. Where the hell are you, little creature thing? You can't get me if I'm not in the water, bro. The way it works. I know how this thing works. I've done this before. Ow! Apparently you're much faster than I thought. A bit faster than I thought. Hey. That was the same with the one in Spooky's House of Jump Scares too, though. Oops. You ready? Set. Wait. Wait a minute. Is there anything in here? You know what? Here. Have a book. Where are you at? Show yourself. The Holy Bible, I think. It has a cross on it. Where are you? 
I think you're right here. Take a book. I don't even think the book exists anymore. Nope. Nope, the water's like acid to uh, objects, apparently. There we go. Run, 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 run. So what you have to do is you just kind of have to stay out of the water as much as possible, pretty much. There we go. No, that's not good. I need something to be able to stand on. There we go. Oh, good. Oh, good. Is that a lever over there? Or a valve? Fantastic. Oh, I can't reach it. Oh, good. That is just wonderful. What else is here? Nothing? Great. Oh, good. Oh, good. Good stuff. Good stuff. And I'm dead. Great. Dead flesh can act as a distraction. Is that the tip? Oh! Oh, thank you! I know what you're talking about. You're talking about all these dead body parts over here, aren't you? Yes, you are indeed. You throw the dead flesh over there and it goes after it. Tries to eat it. Maybe. Not for very long, obviously. Oh wait, maybe it is still going for it. Go for it. Oh, I would have never guessed that. Come on, you bastard. You stupid idiot! I gave you the dead flesh. What the fuck? Come on. Really? Ugh. Oh, this game is awful. Man, after playing Soma, this game is just bad. Maybe I threw it too far? I don't know. All I'm knowing is I'm not really liking this. I am not feeling this game at all. And it's not because it's scary. Where the fuck is the thing? Was that it? Maybe. Here, take some dead flesh. Where is it? Oh. Is it literally just done? It doesn't exist anymore? Yeah, they just gave up. They're like, well, this guy sucks, obviously. Thank you. Oh. Oh, good. Now you're on this side, too. Fantastic. That is just what I needed. Here, go get the arm. Oh, good. Oh, good. It's locked with a simple lock. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm done. Dead flesh can act as a distraction. But it doesn't. It, it literally doesn't work. As far as I can tell, I threw that arm, and it didn't go after the arm. So, I don't know. People say the game is great and all, but I, I don't see it. I'm just not seeing it. So it'll be a bit of a shorter stream. I'm not going to finish this game, obviously, because it's just... It just seems like it's not very well made. You know, I've been stuck multiple times. I've used up all my lantern oil, pretty much. I mean, I have... Yeah, I have literally no lantern oil. I used it all up trying to figure out what I was supposed to do with the puzzle and everything. I can't get this to work. Correctly, anyway. It's to the point where they don't even care about this room anymore. They're like, dude, you suck so much that this... The monster's not even here anymore, dude. See? It just doesn't exist. You don't even have to rotate the valve. It just... You click it, and you rotate it just a little bit, and it just automatically opens. See? Just... Wait, now it's not working. What the hell?
Yeah, this game's definitely got some issues, doesn't it? What the fuck? Okay, now the door's not breaking either? Now I can just open the door? What in the hell is this game? You have to lose to get through some things? I don't know. I don't know. There's what I need, I think. Hello, Needle. That's probably the lockpick this door. That. Yep. Just like that. But like I said, I think I'm done. I was having fun at first, but then it's got phys physics-based puzzles. It's got places where you just get stuck. And that's just not my forte. That's not something that I like. So, yeah, I think that'll be it. I mean, it's been two hours, so it's all right. I'll probably just go back to just normal games for now. We'll just stick with Soma for pretty much for the Halloween, because Soma was great. Soma was made fantastically. I only found that one little error. And there was a couple places where, you know, you get confused. And the, the extent of the physics-based physics -based puzzles in Soma was basically just breaking a window with the fire extinguisher. That's it. Pretty much, as far as I know. Soma is a million times better than this game, and I am just, I'm just not a fan of Amnesia. I knew I wasn't going to be a fan of it. But I gave it a shot, so, you know, that's, that's all you can do, is just give it a shot and try it. But it's not very good. The puzzles are just not good. Some of them are okay. I was okay with the book one. That was a little tricky. And anything like that's fine. But, yeah, I mean, I don't understand. It's some Sometimes the game just doesn't do what it's supposed to do. Like, there was a time when that creature wasn't even there in the water. And then I tried to turn the valve and it just immediately turned itself. And I don't know if maybe that's supposed to happen. But, I don't know. I just don't like the, uh, no information, really. Anyway. Hope you guys did enjoy it. Uh, sorry for the shorter stream. I'll have to find out what I'm going to stream next. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next stream. Bit of us out.